Horses are taking the track for today's seventh. It's the Colin Blair Trophy, a $180,000 claiming event for four years and up. And off they go. Towards the outside, the first to show Samba Dancer, surprisingly. Right there is hard times as they come across the dummy rails at the 7 for a long point. But Tobago is already prompting the issue. So Tobago and hard times from Delium. Um, General Curlin being pushed through on the inside is Mr. Big Shot. Top man is there along with uh, Roll the Dice. Towards the outside is Devlis Isha and they're followed through by Stock Market. But Tobago already establishing an advantage. Three quarters of a length to the good of hard times. Here comes Roll the Dice into the fray along with Delium down on the inside. Mr. Big Shot getting closer. We have got Devlish Isha also there. General Curlin rounding rivals is the stock market. But Tobago in front as they go past the three furlong point here. Tobago on a length and a half advantage and should prove extremely hard to beat from here being pressed by Roll the Dice. On the outside stock market rounds rivals. Uh, also there is Devilish Isha down on the rail hard times but they've got Tobago to catch as they straighten for the drive. Might be the oldest horse in training this Tobago. Two furlongs to run in front here by length. Two lengths clear and beginning to draw off now Tobago. Let's try as uh, uh, as uh, Roll the dice is trying and trying hard. Doesn't look as though he's going to get back on terms as Tobago has a three length buffer coming to the half for a long point. Tobago clear and Tobago will win. It's a matter whether stock market can get past roll the dice. Yes, stock market gets second. Roll the dice is third. Coming on fourth here is Tokus and uh, fifth to Top Man. In the winner's enclosure is horse number three, Tobago. A 10-year-old Bay Gelding by Cadans out of Nuclear Explosion by Bogenius. Owned the businessman, trained O'Neill Markland and bred Ruth Hussey. Richard Mayer is in the saddle. Horse number three, Tobago. Ten years old and still earning. Second to number 14, stock market. Third was number 10, roll the dice. Fourth number 5, tokus. Fifth number 6, top man.
Attention please, ladies and gentlemen, your attention is directed to the winner's enclosure for the presentation of the Colin Blair Trophy. Kindly donated by the United Racehorse Trainers Association in honor of Mr. Colin Blair, founding member of the URTA and who formerly served as General Secretary of the organization. Making the presentation on behalf of trainer Colin Blair is trainer Bill Dina, member of the URTA. And he makes the presentation to Basil Edwards, representing the owner of the winner, the businessman. Trainer Bill Dina will also make the presentation to winning trainer O'Neill Markland. This is gift vouchers kindly donated by Burger King. Also receiving from trainer Bill Dina is the winning jockey, Richard Mares. And the winning groom, Mr. Carl Anglin. There's a bottle of champagne. Mr. Howard Abrams is Wayne Hines, and he receives from trainer L.C. Todd. On behalf of Mr. Abrams, we thank the URTA. Runners are on the track for today's eighth. It's the Richard Azan Trophy. Division two of a maiden condition race for native bred thrills, which have not earned $100,000 since the 19th of May, 2011. And the distance is 1,100 meters. Number two, Miss Sassy Classy make the weight 53.5 kilos for glorification, 51.5. Six Royal Ransom, 52. 11, Catherine the Great, 51. 12, Yes Papa, 52.5. 13, Proven Prospect, 54 kilos. Wagering offer than double, Exacta, Quinella, Trifecta, High Five, and Rolling Triple, four minutes to post. <laughs> 